Good morning everyone and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video I am doing a little mini vlog and we're actually going on a little road trip down to Norwich. Um, I'm saying a little one, it's a three hour drive apparently so not that little. But we are actually going to meet with the people who run Wren to do a breastfeeding photo shoot which I'm actually really excited for. So this has been in the running for I'd say a few months now, but then it's actually been finalised um, over the past couple of weeks. So it's been something that I've looked forward to. Um, but yeah, so we're heading down there now. It is Wednesday, the 27th of September. Um, it's currently like quarter past seven in the morning. So really early, but it's an early start because we've got to travel that far down. So there's me, Neil and Caius travelling down and um, we're actually staying over which has been kindly gifted to us by Wren themselves. Um, if you're not new to my channel you will know I've worked with Wren quite a lot in the past and I'm guessing this is their way of saying thank you, I'm, I'm guessing, um, but either way it's a really really nice gift from them. Paying for his hotel for the night at the venue where we're doing the shoot, which is the Georgian Townhouse in Norwich. And yeah, I'm just really, really grateful um, for this opportunity, I guess. Um, but yeah, like I said, I've worked with them a while in the past. Um, I've done plenty of like reels, I did their TikTok for a little while, and you know, it's just a really, really nice small kind of business to work with um i found the women who run it very very friendly and you know it's just been an all-round nice journey with them like from the start to be honest so yeah i'm really grateful to be able to have this opportunity to go down there do a shoot with them and meet loads of load uh, meet loads of new like well are, are they influencers or them you know i don't know mums i guess i don't know what to call them but because um, I don't know exactly who everyone is. I recognise some faces from Instagram, um, but I don't know, you know, if someone's an influencer or, you know, just a standard mum. But yeah, so either way, I'm going to go and meet some new people, have a lovely time, and just enjoy it, I guess. So our Oscar is actually staying with my nana tonight. He's got nursery this morning. So I've cleared it all with nursery that my nan's taking him and picking him up, and... Um, yeah, then he's having a sleepover at my nana's, which I know both of them will love because it's company for my nan and Oscar loves it at my nana's as well. So that'll be really nice for him to have some time with my nan. And yeah, it's just going to be a fun, fun day, hopefully. So I'm going to vlog along the way. Um, I'll do you a little room tour, but it might be towards the end of the day that because I'm going straight to the shoot. Neil will be going to the room earlier in the day, obviously, because he's not at the shoot. Um, and then, yeah, I'll just take it take it as we find it sort of thing so i hope you enjoy this little vlog thank you again ren for giving me the opportunity to work with you all these times it's been really really nice and um yeah i'm hoping we have a lovely day and i will take you along with us so yeah i will see you all in a little bit when we arrive in norwich i'm going to do my makeup in the car hopefully kais is going to have a little nap and he's a bit grumpy at the moment <laughs> because we had to wake him up this morning so he's not the happiest but yeah we'll see anyway so I'll check in with you all in a bit and yeah that's it Tomorrow, 
let's have a drink just relax all your problems will fade if you're ready for a good time count on me there's a party in the backyard dance your problems away i'm all about the good vibes i know you're all about the good vibes do you know how much i love you want to see you smile where's the happy girl that i know with the heart on I'll do anything to make it fine, but I can tell that you have something on your mind right now. But I will make you forget all your sorrows. Let go like there's no tomorrow. Let's have a drink, just relax. All your problems will fade if you're ready for a good time. Count on me. There's a So good afternoon, um, the shoot has literally just finished and I've just come back to our room because we're staying over for the night as I mentioned earlier. Um, so I just thought before I even catch up with you all I would do a little room slash apartment tour for you so that's what I'm going to do. So we're actually staying in this little apartment here so the hotel is just round there across the road and these are all apartment blocks there's like one down there which is lovely we've just had some photos in there and now we're staying in the colonel's retreat so as you first come in you get a nice little kitchenette um it's really nice it's equipped with you know some little basics some biscuits and tea and coffee there is an espresso machine little microwave and yeah there's this gorgeous little kitchenette space Get this nice mirror and dining table which is perfect for the amount of people here so i've actually just put my pram there so there's you know plenty of room for a pram and then at the night time you can obviously just draw this curtain and the blinds so going through here this is the first time i've come in as well so this is really exciting this is our bathroom so gorgeous old-fashioned sink um hello uh, it's lovely old style shower and nice little bath there um toilet and i'm guessing that's just store cupboard so going back out of this room we will go upstairs first so up here is this nice little sitting area and um, there's like a window down there downstairs our oh, Caius is just sat chilling with the mirror are you looking at yourself is that you <coughs> yeah and um, this is like the little sitting area so neil's actually brought his xbox a monitor so he's brought all that he's just been chilling there all day we've got a telly and then this nice little um lounge area which is really nice a few drinks and stuff up there which is good um i think it's like some norfolk wine and beer um yeah so that's good some biscuits crisps and whatnot don't know what's in here oh it's just like a little cupboard and um, there's also a nice big fan which is great for the heat wave and then we've got this lovely little balcony here as well and um, which looks out onto some of the other rooms which is really nice so then i'm guessing the rooms are downstairs yep. so we're going to go back down uh, round here and then down these stairs there is nice little mirror there which is great there is this room which is actually so spacious um i probably should turn the lights on but you know um there is a huge double bed there and tv so yeah this is absolutely gorgeous back out this room we have got oh another double um so again another lovely sized room nicely decorated little radio a fan there's obviously the big huge bed and another TV which is great um, so yeah and then back out here that's just like a little storage unit but yeah that is the little apartment tour so really really nice so going back up now back upstairs so that's the um, 
little apartment tour done like i said this is the colonel's retreat and ren have kindly paid for our stay here which is really really kind it's a lovely little apartment perfect for if you've got kids although if you have got babies i would recommend just bringing something to close off the stairs um because like i said there's two sets of stairs here but yeah it's really really nice um so i'm just going to chill out for a little bit and then i will come back on later on and you know just fill you in on the day um and we'll have a catch up in a bit once i've you know took all my makeup off and stuff but it's been a really really good day neil have you had a good day yeah. neil's loved it because he's been child free sat on his xbox so he's absolutely loved it um so yeah i'll catch up with you in a bit and i will talk soon Can I tell you what's been on my mind? Sick and tired of the nine to five in the city light. Hey, darling, we could get out of town. See the beautiful world around, want to see it now. Pack our bags and get in that car. So, good evening. It's now half past five. Um, I've had a bath, taken all my makeup off, and I feel so much better. Got some jammers on, little vest top, and I just, you know, when you're just getting your comfies and you feel just nice and relaxed. Um, honestly, this little um, apartment is so cute. Kaius, can you not please grab my camera? Thank you, gorgeous. Um, it's so nice. Me and Neil were saying we would actually live in here. If it was just me and Neil and we didn't have any kids, like we would fully live in this apartment. It is so nice and cosy. Like, I actually love it. Um, it's really, really nice. Feels so homely as well. Sometimes, you know when you go stay at a hotel and it just feels a little bit bland and just not very homey. This is so, so lovely. Like I said, I can't speak on behalf of the hotel rooms because i've not seen them but just going off this apartment alone i think it's honestly just great um yeah so as for today i'm so sorry about this as well it keeps trying to grab my camera so i'm having to constantly rearrange it so on about today um it's honestly been so good finally meeting the team from wren apparently Jody, who i usually am in contact with she unfortunately was not very well which was a shame because i was really really excited to meet in her um yeah so i'm i'm gutted i couldn't meet her so jody if you ever watch this by the time this goes up i'm pretty sure you will be much better by then but you know i'm sending you all the well wishes that i can now hannah um the other lady who works for ren um i've been in contact with her a few times and i finally got to meet her today so that was so so nice you know when you've had like i don't want to say like a working relationship because it's not that deep but like i've worked with ren a few times on instagram youtube tiktok stuff like that and to finally put like faces to name in person is really really nice and as i've mentioned to a few girls today like the one thing that i actually love about ren is they are so caring about who they work with they're very thoughtful and the amount of effort that goes into absolutely everything um it's not just a company that are like buy our breast pumps you know work with us collaborate with us like they've pulled this off today and it's been absolutely amazing sorry about his growling the amount of detail that's gone into it the thought behind it and just the attention to detail and like i said they're just to be fair this is probably one of my most favorite brands i have worked with at all because like i said they're just so kind and caring um so yeah i just want to say jody and anna anyone else behind the scenes who work at Ren, i just want to say huge huge thank you um the opportunity we've had today has been absolutely amazing you've made it a day to remember for sure it's been a lovely little family getaway even though our oscar isn't here he's been on plenty of stuff in the past um so it's been nice to just have a little family night away with our kaias for the first time 
and um, it's just honestly been great so yeah I just truly want to say thank you for that because there is so many people and companies and that, that you can work with but I feel like there's only a short not sure there's only a small amount that you can actually say give a shit basically and I feel like everyone at Ren truly does give a shit so yeah um yeah so as for today anyways um like I said it's been lovely to meet the team the photographer was lovely as well I think the photographer had a friend there I can't quite remember her name and I can't remember the photographer's name I'm rubbish with names um they were also lovely it made everyone feel so confident and at ease and i think that's so important when it comes to such like a vulnerable shoot um i say vulnerable because we're all mums mums have a lot of um i don't want to say issues but you know things to do with like confidence and because his body changes a lot when you become a mom and it takes a lot to you know have the guts to share your postpartum body share like just the real side of motherhood and that's something i really appreciated about today everyone was so good in giving each other confidence boost like everyone was complimenting each other and it was just a real real good bunch of girls to like do this with and i'm honestly proud that i can be part of this like breastfeeding yeah. shoot because we was from all different backgrounds all shapes all sizes all ages we all had different amount of kids and it's just yeah. been really nice knowing that we've all come together to show what I would consider true motherhood. Um, and yeah, honestly, it was so nice like to see other mums breastfeeding. And I know that's the whole point. But you know, sometimes when you go places, as a breastfeeding mum this time, you don't see many people breastfeeding. Or sometimes if you do, they're quite covered up. And, you know, it isn't very noticeable because many mums are very discreet about it, which is great. Um, but today, everything was just out in the open. We saw nipples, we saw stretch marks, there was like bellies, there was cellulite, there was everything, you know. Everything that has made me a mum, like all those things have happened to my body since becoming a mum. And it was so nice to just be there and experience it out in the open with lots of other mums. Um, so yeah, I've, just, I've honestly loved today. It's been such... <laughs> what are you doing, mister? Are you busy exploring? He's into everything here. Um, it's just honestly been such a great, great day. I've, I've really, really enjoyed it. Um, we got a few freebies from today, which was lovely. So I managed to pick up... Obviously, I didn't get anything what I've already got at home. What's up, mister? I think this one is tired. It's been very, very tired today. I'm just going to prop you up a minute. Because not everyone wants a flash of a cheeky nipple. There you are, baby. He's tired. Um, yeah, so, basically, what I was saying... There was a few freebies. Like, all the REM products were there. I managed to get a few stickers. I didn't get anything that I've already got at home. Because I thought, you know... There's plenty to go around. I don't need any extras. But what I did get was some reusable breast pads to try because I haven't actually got any of those. So they hopefully will come in really handy because I still leak. Um, and I also grabbed some more storage bags because I will be continuing to pump um, because I'm actually going back to work in about two weeks. So I need all the storage bags I can get. Um, so yeah, that's that's what I got today and like I said I grabbed some stickers and stuff which is good because I love having those up around my house um, I've also been taking them to like local places that allow breastfeeding and putting them up there as well um, so yeah it's really really good um, as I said we've met loads of new mums today loads of new babies the kids were honestly great I was worrying so much thinking oh is our guy going to be crying all day is he you know I mean he did get quite overtired around dinner time um dinner by the way it was gorgeous um and then yeah the kids were just great the honestly you would not have thought that there was about 30 odd kids there today was it 30 odd i don't know i could be exaggerating there but either way we've met some lovely new like mum friends and new babies and it was just something that i will treasure with me forever especially because the photos that i get from today because i know i'm not having any more babies like we've come to the decision we're not having any more kids um these are going to be like photos that i treasure forever like these this is my last breastfeeding journey um 
so yeah it's something i do want to treasure the location was absolutely gorgeous it was just at the hotel over the road mr grumpy tonight aren't you you really are mr grumpy he's been overtired all day do you have to say hello say hello uh, yeah, thought you'd be happy uh, now. He's also cutting two more teeth, so that's uh, been fun. Let me just move you back, so otherwise you'll be grabbing my camera. <laughs> we got this lovely baby girl, by the way. It says Choose Love. It's basically the charity that Ren work with. Um, so yeah, we got this to bring home. I forgot what else I said. Oh yeah, location. Location has been gorgeous. The weather's been great. We actually did a lot of the group shoots outside. I cannot pardon you. I cannot wait to like get a hold of some of them if by the time this video is being edited before it goes out if i get some of those photos i'll try and pop them on screen if i can or any clips i manage to get hold of um so yeah it's just honestly been a lovely lovely day and i couldn't have asked to do it with a better group of people to be honest so thanks again everyone at ren jody hannah thank you for putting your heart and soul into this because it has been brilliant now anyways i'm going to get off i can see i've been rambling for 10 and a half minutes which is obviously quite a lot so i apologize um the vlog will continue until we go home tomorrow um right now we're actually just going to get settled down we're going to go give our kais a quick bath and we're also going to have mcdonald's for tea which is a nice little treat um and yeah i will see you all probably in a little bit if i've got anything else to update you on if not i will see you in the morning at some point but yeah, I just want to say thanks and um, I hope you've been enjoying this little vlog. And yeah, I will see you all very shortly. Good morning everyone. So I just thought I'd quickly check in and close off the vlog because I didn't want to just leave it how I did last night. Um, so I've literally checked out. We're just at the fuel station now filling up. Um, and we're heading off home. I cannot wait to see our Oscar. I've proper missed him. Um, it's weird. Once you've got two kids, I think, going away with just one it just doesn't feel right although it's been lovely it really has i just think oh i want both my babies do you know what i mean um our Caius is actually fast asleep he's snoring his head off there so i'm just gonna leave him to it hopefully he sleeps a decent way of the way home so we've currently got a three hour drive pending which is fun um but yeah, so we're on the way home now. Um, I've got plenty of footage. I cannot wait to edit this vlog back. I've just contacted Hannah and Jodie to say like, thank you for everything. Like it's truly been an amazing like opportunity to come down here um, because I'd probably never ever come to Norwich in my life. Um, so it's been a nice excuse to travel somewhere new and um, just have a night away basically and actually meet like new people um so yeah it's been really fun i've just thanked them and um we're on his way home also next up on my channel this weekend um so it's thursday today on saturday i have actually been nominated for a yorkshire blogger award in the parenting category so i'm actually going to be heading up there um to to leeds on saturday for an event so i'll be vlogging that so yeah that should be really fun so that will be next up on my channel um also i just want to give a quick mention if you do happen to you know if you haven't heard of ren before prior to this vlog or if you have and you know you're just after a few more breastfeeding accessories like pumps nipple bubbles breast pads you know breastfeeding milk storage bags i'm trying to think like anything related to breastfeeding if you need anything please remember to go check out the ren website i will leave their website in the description box down below i'll also put the instagram um so make sure you go check them out and if you do happen to want anything i do have a code it's an affiliate link code um but the code is brody Bridock x i will leave it on screen use that it'll save you a little bit of money i hope you manage to get everything you need and that is it from me so we're heading off home now thank you very much neil um closing this vlog i hope you've enjoyed it thanks again to hannah and jody and i will see you all on the next one bye everyone